G'day, Lemon Eating Cow here, and today I am back with a Final Fantasy VIII Remaster news video. So if you didn't know, earlier this year Square Enix announced that they would be releasing Final Fantasy VIII, a remastered version, on the current gen consoles. That being the Xbox One, the PS4, and the PC via Steam. Final Fantasy VIII was originally released on the PS1 20 years ago, and with the recent passing of the 20th anniversary, we didn't hear any news of it, and it was really actually quite disappointing to a lot of fans. Final Fantasy VIII has been pretty much ignored on all occasions by Square Enix, so everyone was really doubtful that we would be getting this remaster. But thankfully, it is definitely coming, and Square Enix have released a date for it as well. You can actually pre-order the game right now, but it will be fully available on the 3rd of September 2019. All versions of the game will offer a cheat menu, much like the Final Fantasy VII current gen release. And these will give you things like triple speed mode, uh, battle assist mode, which matches your HP and your limit gauge, and also the ability to turn off random encounters. However, if you purchase this on Steam, you will get quite a few more options as well. You can also have the option of turning on all items, uh, all abilities, Guardian Force max level, max skill, max magic, so you won't have to draw a heap of magic from enemies all the time, all limit breaks, and all cards. This will include all the cards except the rare cards. So if you are just looking to purely play through the game and you just want to break the hell out of it, then I would recommend the Steam version. But really, all of these codes are going to take pretty much the entire body out of the game. So if you're playing it for the first time, then you definitely won't be missing these. I am personally extremely excited to be picking up a copy of it on the PS4. I haven't played this for 20 odd years and I am really, really looking forward to getting back into it. I can honestly say that I actually enjoyed Final Fantasy VIII a lot more than Final Fantasy VII. Uh, just the characters and the art style and a little bit of updated graphics and things like that. And especially the Guardian Force system too. I really, really enjoyed this game. It'll be interesting for me to go back and play it so far on in time and see if I do enjoy it as much as I originally did. Because I know with the other titles, um, Final Fantasy IX and Final Fantasy X, I didn't originally like those games at all, story-wise, uh, but going back and playing them recently on the channel, uh, you can watch the playthroughs actually on the channel, I really did enjoy it and I, I really loved the story and um, I really got back into the characters of 9 and 10, so hopefully the positive vibes do keep up with Final Fantasy VIII, but uh, we will see. If I do have the time, I will be playing it on the channel, but recently I have had very, very little time. So um, it's a pretty low possibility, but I really hope to share it with you guys in some form, maybe my impressions or something of it. And I really hope that if you pick it up, you enjoy the game too. So again, Final Fantasy VIII, the remaster, will release on September the 3rd, and you can actually pre-order now. It's available on Xbox One, PS4, and the PC via Steam. Let me know in the comment section down below, have you played Final Fantasy VIII before? Because I would guess a younger generation that doesn't really have access to emulators or anything like that wouldn't have actually got an opportunity to play VIII before. So this may be VIII getting introduced to an entire new generation. If you have played it before and you like it or you don't like it, uh, let me know in the comment section below. And hit that thumbs up button if this info was helpful. Until next time, this has been Lemon Eating Cow. And hey... You're the best looking guy here. Moo.